One coalition of civil society jambo they don't call me they come out transfer food from staple foods when say Nigerian people they chop. The coalition saying take off transfer for food, fit cause stroke, heart disease, hypertension, kidney disease, and blockage of arteries plus other sickness. They say the cost of treatment of disease when we say transfer the cost is they high. I don't want to make the federal government regulate how they go take the take them. This has been a practice that has been ongoing for a while that we think now needs to be stopped because uh, these trans fatty acids have the potential uh, to cause cardiovascular disease, which is heart disease, stroke, hypertension, uh, blockage of, of the arteries. It also has the potential to cause kidney disease, to cause diabetes, uh, to cause obesity, and can also cause uh, cancers. A lot of the foods that are produced in the major uh, fast food uh, establishments, uh, people who, who, who bake all, all types of very thick, uh, sweet things that we like, those who make pizza, etc., tend to have very high concentrations of trans fatty acids. The economic costs of treating some of those diseases highlighted here are extremely high. Neither do we have the necessary infra infrastructure to, to do that. So we want our government to act very fast on the issue of the regulation. We are also using this medium to urge Nigerians to check you know, on this food, the contents, and begin to opt for alternatives. Nigerians should now begin to re re reject trans fat lead foods because um, they are injurious to the health of our citizens. Our interest is the health of our people in Nigeria and whatever needs to be done to promote the health of Nigerians um, we have, we buy into it and we want to support this effort. And we call on the press, men who are here, the media people to help us. We're trying to change the perception of people and habits die hard. There's something because the issue of transfer is predicated on the culture of our people as well and also the dietary pattern in the country. So it's not going to be an easy uh, war, but the journey of a thousand kilometers begins with a step and we have taken it.